All right, people. Welcome back to some more League. So this is the end of week four standing. So I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a summary of what happened in the previous week, end of week four. And uh, go ahead and give you guys the standings going into week five. So starting off, match one, we had the Yuya Pendulum Dragons using Pendulum Magicians versus the Kaba White Dragons using Cleese in a divisional match. It was a battle of the Wavering Eyes, and in the end, Cleese won, earning them one point in this divisional match. In match two, we had the Yusei Star Dragons using their two tier tier two deck. Oh my god, I cannot speak of Rodic Beast versus uh no, no, their tier three deck. Well, I think Rodic Beast for tier two. Tier three Rodic Beast versus the Yugi Dark Magicians using their tier two deck of trains. And Yugi needs to go back and train with them trains because there were some serious misplays and uh, the <laughs> uh, simply allowing the Yusei Star Dragons to earn two points off of that one. In match three, we had the Yuma Utopians using Necros versus the, the Kite Galaxy Photons using the Sunjus. And for some reason, whenever Necros step up to the plate, they get crushed by the fact that there's just so much hate in that uh, side deck. So uh, the Kite the Galaxy Photons end up winning it with a 2 2 deck versus a tier one deck and earning themselves. Uh, oh, I apologize, people. I apologize, people. Earning themselves at two points. And the last match, we had the Jack Red Archfiends versus the Zane Cyber Dragons, a divisional match. They both decided to go with their tier three decks, Worms versus Dozens, and Worms pulled it out, uh, earning them, uh, earning the Jack Red Archfiends one point. So now let's go ahead and go over the current standings going into week five so in the top division or the ycs division and first we have the kaiba white dragons with four points tied for second we have the yuya pendulum dragons and the kite galaxy photons both three three points and sadly at the rear hopefully they'll be able to pull it up in the last three weeks of the regular season we have the Union utopians with zero points you need to get on it earn ah, earn some points win them duels all right and in the lower division you say star dragons with a whopping six points say what so many points earned uh just winning with them tier two and tier three decks and stealing points away from higher tier decks and just Keep on earning them, keep on earning them with six whole points. But not very far behind, we have the Jack Red Archmeans with four points. In third place, we have the Zane Cyber Dragon still pulling it up with two points. And at the end, we have the Yugi Dark Magician with zero points. So the Yugi Dark Magicians and the Yumi Topians can still pull it up, still get in to the playoffs, which is what they're trying to go. You know, the bye week is nice and all, but just make it to the playoffs, people. So, I hope that you guys are excited for Week 5. It will be going up soon, so please be sure to continue to support the league. We are, I'd say, about halfway done. I'd say we're about halfway done. we got Weeks 5, 6, and uh, 7, and then the playoffs. Uh, so, and then after that, that's it. That's it. It's end of Season 1. So, you know, continue to support me and the league and all the participants in the league. So I hope that you guys enjoy this week's matches. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I hope that you guys enjoy. All right, people, see you guys soon.